Hi again. After all of that, it cut me off for some reason. So I guess we're two videos now. Won't be much on the second one, but I don't know what else to do. All right, I'm looking at where I might need to adjust things. This feels a little skinny on this side. I'm sure your angle makes things look a little different than they are. Sorry, I've just plugged in my microphone. I had to unplug it to see what happened. And uh, yeah, I don't know why that happened. I wasn't near it. Okay, I'm looking around to see where we might need to adjust things. See, I'm thinking that tree goes down too far. I was just painting away and I realized you left me. Why do you leave me? <sighs> I tried combining two videos one time in iMovie, you know, because um, I know people stop and start and it let me do that, but then it wouldn't upload it to YouTube. It said it was too big, which is probably true. My movies are pretty big, aren't they? My videos. All right, let's see. I think what other things we need here we don't have. What we like and what we don't like. Well, I guess we don't have to rush now because this movie, this one won't be so big, will it? Because your angle's not dead on. I kind of show you where I am. What do I like and what don't I like? I don't think the back edge of that barn is important that it be real defined. I softened that up. You know, I don't want things to look folk arty. You know, I want them to be impressionistic. If you get too particular and too hard edged, I, th I think then they tend to take on a folk art look. Kind of checking some angles as I talk about not making things too hard edged. I'm defining some edges, right? Um, There's a telephone pole in the middle of there. Do we want that? Do we care about that? It kind of falls dead center. I could move it over and run a line to the to the barns. Still not wild about this little thing. I think part of it's a uh, maybe just the shape of it. It actually does not overhang like I've got it. It's more like that. And there's some stuff going on in that barn. I just don't know if I care about it. And this one back here, I didn't really want to draw your eye to it. Um, don't know if it even adds anything to the painting. I just thought it might keep your eye moving through the painting if it were there, though.
against it. And here with my face in it, so long, you know. like you know this side's a little wide on this barn just by looking at it that feels a little better kind of like all these dark and light patterns I kind of like that I've got going Use its rubber knife a lot tonight, haven't we? Once you get going with it, it's kind of fun. I'm laying on some heavier paint. I probably blocked your view, didn't I? Back in there is pretty light, but I don't know that we want it, you know. I'd rather keep your eye in here. Put a little bit of lighter stuff in there. Maybe direct your eye up to the barn, maybe. dark in there because I thought it felt like then you, you know, it was coming down, the hillside was coming down from the barn. I kind of like that. All right, what do we think? Are we about calling it quits? Oh, I don't like this. Too dark coming out of there. about this dead tree either, you know. I feel like they're all a little even. This does create some really fine little branches. shape. All right, what do we think? A few little things bug me. A little silo, I just did not feel any. And I don't know if I just haven't drawn him well. I'm trying to look at where the light's catching him. Maybe he's too tall. Could be. Maybe he's too tall. He is kind of squatty. If we're going to bring him up, though, we need to define the base. Shadow out. Put a little 
green in him because he would be, you know, green reflecting in him, I'm sure, from the grass. Part of me wants to cover up the rest of this warm color, but I'm going to leave it because I think that's the right thing to do. Okay, well, I'm going to move in and show it to you. I'm sure there's things I'm missing. Again, I don't want every little thing though, you know. There's a little quilt back there on that barn, but uh, let's put a little warm in this side though that's coming toward us. You know, I think it's good that it's a little bit, maybe a different color than the one back there. Again, please like and subscribe, and um, like I said, I'll have a link below for my website if you want to check me out. I think somebody might like my channel, maybe tell them about it. At this point, I don't have a lot of subscribers. But I keep going. I enjoy it. Again, that little thing bothers me, and I don't really, I think it must be the shape of it, so. You know, it's usually what it is, a drawing error of some kind. And the fence I mostly scratched in, but, you know, I may decide to darken some of it up like that. We'll see. And the shadow will need to be there. Okie doke. I'm going to shut up and get off here and I'll back up and show it to you so you can get a better angle on it. I'm sorry about the two videos that just shut off on me there. <laughs> 